With little knowledge of how to run a business, Shamsa Wasavi decided to open a restaurant and a spice store in the Sugwakif market in Doha. When she started, she knew it was going to be a challenge, but she didn't expect reports that follow, saying she is the first woman to own a business at the popular market. I'm the first businesswoman to enter Sukhwakif because I wanted to help support my retired husband. I started from scratch, listening to what I learned from my late father, because he was a successful trader man. Initially, she sold pickles in the pet area of the market. One day, she caught the attention of a photographer who took her photo and shared the story of the first female trader in the Kateri market. The love of my culture, the love of my country, that's how I like to show people who are visiting Qatari culture, through the food and hospitality. While the market was under construction, managers encouraged her to open her spices store, something she was hesitant to do. Working with men was a first for her, but she says most have been supportive. This woman is very special. You see her eyes? These are eyes of emotion, because when you meet her, she truly transmits the strength, courage, and love that she has for what she has created, for her nation, for her people, and for all of us who are foreigners. She makes us feel as if we were part of her family. Awasavi says she has set a precedent for the market and for all Qatari women many of whom, she says, are afraid to take leadership positions or become active members of the economy and workforce. She shows us how much difference one woman can make, changing how we view the world. We are in an Arab world. We are in a world where women must follow certain paths, and she is unique in that world. Over time, her 12-chair restaurant has expanded to seat 250 guests. With each of these traditional Qatari dishes, this chef has managed to win the hearts not only of the people in her country, but also of visitors from all over the world. Celia Mendoza, VOA News, Doha, Qatar.